All right, everyone go to attention. And balcony eight. All right, student attendance and begin. Honor, courtesy, integrity, perseverance, self-control, courage, and community. Balcony eight. All right, and June B. All right, from here, we're going to go ahead and start with, I always forget to do that. We're all gonna go ahead and get started with, uh, we're gonna start off with some jumping jacks today. All right, so I want everyone do some awesome jumping jacks best you can. Make sure you get a full swing of those arms, full, full fledged, full big swing jumping jacks. All right, we're gonna do that for 45 seconds. And go. Hey, this clicker's working for me today so far. I like this. We're on a roll, that's three for three. All right, here we go, jumping jacks, jumping jacks. Very good, very good. Keeping it going, keeping it going. 30 seconds. Sorry, pet peeve when I can see the, the mat coming up. Hey, keeping it going, keeping it going. 15 seconds. Good job, keeping it moving. Ooh, that last sip of coffee was not a good idea. All right, here we go. Almost there. Three, two, one, and time. All right, from here, we're going to go ahead and do some squats. All right, if you want to take it a second or a second step up, I want you to do some jump squats. All right, you ready? And go. Either squats or jump squats. Your choice. Your choice. But you got to be squatting one way or another. Very good. Keep it up. Keep it up. Doing good. There you go. Keep it going. Keep it going. 25 seconds. I'm going to do a mixture of both just that way. Get them both in. There we go. Remember, when we're doing squats, keep that back straight. Even if you have to look up, that's okay. Good. Keep going. Eight seconds. And time. All right, from here, everyone down on your bellies. We're going to do some push ups. Going to work those arms out. 45 seconds. How many can you do in 45 seconds? And begin. Good. Keeping it going. Keeping it going. 25 seconds. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Going down. Going up. Good, Dane. Good job. Keep it going. Keep it going. Doing good, everybody. Pushing it, pushing it, pushing it. Working out those arm muscles. Five seconds. You're almost there. Keep it going. Very good. Next one. We're going to go ahead and roll onto our back. We're going to do some flutter kicks. So don't put your hands on your butt. And then you're going to take your legs out just like so. And kick. Keeping your legs fully extended. When your foot goes down, you do not want to rest it on the ground. You want to keep it about six inches up from the ground. Very good, very good. 15 seconds. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Come on, you got this, 10 seconds. Don't give up, don't give up. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. All right, next we're gonna do, we're gonna do reverse crunches. So you're here, you're gonna bring your knee up and then back down, just like so, just like so. And begin, you're gonna lean a little backwards. You wanna get your butt a little bit off the ground. So make sure we're not doing like a big full swing. Just a little bit. Keep it going, keep it going. 20 seconds. Halfway there. Halfway there. Very good, 10 seconds. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Good, 
and time. All right. From here, we're going to go ahead and move into stretching. Oh, now the button don't want to work. Whatever. It turned the time off. That's what matters. All right. From here, we're going to go ahead and stretching. Everyone take your hands forward, arm swings. Very good, very good. And backwards. Great job, great job. Now take your arms out and across. Arm swing. Very good, keep it going, keep it going. All right, now we're gonna take our hips in circles. Hip circles. Very good, very good. Other way. Awesome job, team. Doing great. Looking good. Keep it going. Stretching is important. All right, now we're gonna take bring our feet together. We're gonna do spin down and we're gonna do knee circles. And we're gonna go the other way. Excellent, excellent. All right, from here. Now we're gonna lift our foot up and we're gonna do ankle circles, ankle rotations. Working on that balance as well. Other way. Very good, very good. All right, now switch foot, switch your, the other foot, other way. Very good, very good. Another direction. Very good, all right. Feet apart, hands on your hips, side to side. Awesome team, doing great, doing great. Now we're gonna take our hips forward and backwards. Make sure we stretch everything as much as possible. Excellent, excellent. All right, now from here, I want you to take your hand out, up and down, just like so. We're gonna take that same leg, the same side leg. We're gonna swing it in a circle and hit our hand, just like so. And other side. All right, now from here, we're gonna take our leg. We're gonna do leg lift to the side. Go ahead and begin. All right, other way. Okay, now we're gonna take our hands, put them on our back. We're gonna take our head ear to shoulder. Very good, up and down. And left or right. Awesome, awesome. All right, now take our head in a circle. Other way.
Very good job. All right, now shake everything out real quick. Shake it all out. There we go. All right, from here, everyone change the stance. Looking sharp, looking strong, and balcony yay. All right, from here, everyone do beast or uh, sparring stance. Sorry, sparring stance. Direction, sparring stance. All right, from here, what we're going to start off today is I've I've wrote I've written down a few combinations. All right, to help with us, I'm come up with combinations, thinking of different moves that we could do. Think about doing moves maybe we know in different orders, and potentially maybe learning some new moves. Okay. So the first one we're gonna start off with, we're here in our spine stance, we're gonna take our front leg, we're gonna do a front kick, land with a jab, okay? Jab is a front hand, lead hand. So if this leg's in front, this is my jab hand. With this leg being in the back, this is my cross. If I was to switch, then my hand switch. This hand would be a jab, this hand would be a cross. Okay, but I'm starting with my left leg, your, what it looks like to be your, my right leg for you in front. I'm going to do a front leg front kick, same hand punch. I keep my hand. Hang on, Miss Peyton. Just like so. All right, you ready? Hang on, Miss Peyton has a question. Oh, Let me unmute okay. her real quick. Oh, what's your question, sweetheart? Yeah, you can't hear him? If he talks without the headset, can you hear him? You want me to try that? Yes. All right, here we go, here we go. Uh, microphone. All right, Peyton, can you hear me better? Can you hear him now, sweetheart? Okay. Can she? Yes, okay. I can hear you, you, sometimes I can hear her. All right, so from here, I'm gonna repeat myself. If this leg's in front, then this hand is a jab. Back leg, back hand is a cross. If I switch feet, my hands switch. This one's now the jab, and this one is the cross right here. Okay, it depends on which leg's in front. So I'm gonna start off with my left leg, what it looks like for you, my right leg. I'm here, I'm gonna do a front leg, front kick, same side jab. Notice my hand stays right by my face the whole time. Hands stay up the whole time, just like so. Okay, we're gonna do that five times on each side. Here we go, y'all ready? And one. Good, move in, move in, two. Good, very good, very good. Keep it moving, side to side. Good, three. Good, very good, very good. Four. Excellent, excellent. And five. Very good, all right, let's go to the other side. Here we go. Remember, this hand's now your jab, so we're punching with the other hand, kicking with the other leg. And one, good, moving around, moving around, staying loose. Two, good, biggest step I ever got when sparring is to stay loose until you go into it to strike, okay? Make sure you stay nice and flexible, all right? And three, good, moving, moving, moving. Four, very good, very good. Excellent, I see a lot of movement on my screen. That's good, five. Excellent, all right, go ahead and switch legs. Back to the other leg in front. We're gonna build to that. Okay, we're gonna now do a front kick, jab. We're gonna add a cross to a back leg round kick. Okay, so one more time, we're here. I'm gonna do a front kick, jab, cross, round kick with the back leg. Make sure when you're doing that cross, you turn that foot, okay? Get some more, a little more power, but also kind of sets you up for the round kick. And then make sure when you're doing that round kick, the leg on the ground pivots, okay? Make sure it pivots for your safety. All right, and then land it in front, just like I did. Don't do like I did earlier, it's gone all around. You're here, front kick, jab, cross, round kick, land forward. Land forward. Here we go, y'all ready, hands up. All right, here we go. And one. Good. And then you gotta put that leg back, that leg back in front again. Moving side to side. Keep it moving. Keep them bodies moving. And two. Very good. Very good. Keeping it moving. Keeping it moving. Three. Very good. Very good. Keep it moving, good job, four. Excellent, excellent. And five. 
Very good, very good. All right, so that's a little bit of a beginner level. It's basically that's warming us up, getting us good to go. Now we're gonna add a change up a little bit. So we're still gonna do the front leg front kick. We're still gonna do a jab and a cross. But now we're going to do a jump round kick. Okay, some of you may practice with this a little bit, some may not. It's okay. All you gotta do is squat down a little bit. And when you jump, you're gonna push off this heel to turn that body, okay? Notice how I'm doing this. This leg's just jumping, this leg's helping with the twist. So then when I jump, I can kick with it. All right? So, one more time. Front kick, jab, cross, round kick. I believe. We did the round kick on the other side, right? Just the regular round kick? Pretty sure we did. We didn't practice it later, okay? So we're here. All right, ready? Front kick, jab, cross, jump, round kick. And keeping it moving side to side. Start moving, start moving. Here we go. One. Good, very good. This is, jumps will help you if you want to get contact to the head gear. Head gear. All right, keeping it moving. Two. Very good, very good. And three. Awesome job, awesome job. And four. Very good. I'm gonna watch this last one, last one, and five. Front kick, jab cross, jump, round kick. Excellent. Very good, all right, other side. Other side, here we go. Y'all ready? Move in. Keep it moving, don't get still. Don't be still. And one, jab, front kick, jab, cross, jump, round kick. Just remember, you will have one side that may look a lot better than the other. That's okay. You're gonna have your great side, and then you're gonna have your good side. All right, here we go. And two. Awesome job, awesome job. And three. Very good, very good. Working from side to side, walking from side to side. Circling, we're circling. Just like so. Good. Four. Slow. Do what now? Can you say that again? Somebody say something? Thought I hear somebody's voice. Did I hear anybody's voice? No, okay. Dexter, is that a thumbs up that you can hear me or a thumbs up you got, you want a question or something? No, no question? Okay, here we go, last one. On this side, jab, uh, front kick, jab, cross, jump, round kick. You ready? Here we go, hands up. And five, front kick, jab, cross, jump, round kick. There we go, good. All right, next combination we got. Okay, next combination we got. Starts off with a spin side kick. Okay, so you're here. When you start here, you're gonna need to turn towards your back leg. So my front leg's here. I can't really turn this way very far, not without having to move something. But here, I can turn all the way around. See how I can turn all the way around? That's what you want. So if you're going to turn, you have to stop. You might be turning the wrong way, okay? So we're here. We're gonna turn, pick this leg up, and side kick straight out. As soon as you can see your target in front of you. Remember, do not kick blindly. Okay, do not kick blindly. Make sure that you kick looking at your target. All right, here we go. You ready? We're gonna start off with that. We'll build from there. Ready, moving, hands up. Let me see those moving. Let me see us moving. Here we go, and one. Land it in front, then move it back behind you. So once you do that side kick, you land it in front, and then switch back. All right, here we go. And two. Yeah, right. What's your question, Azarel? No donkey kicks in a spin side kick. The what? No donkey kicks. If, like, if you don't see your target, 
your target, you're going to hit somewhere else. Mm. Yes, that's correct. Yes. yes. I got you now. I got what you're saying. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That's correct. Dane, you got something, buddy? All right. Hold on. Okay, what's up? Whenever I do my spin circuit, um, I spin back so that it can go um, back behind. That in sparring, you want to land in front. And the reason being is because when – I'm not saying you're wrong, okay, by any means. There's a lot of times where even when I do a suspense sidekick, I bring it back too, okay? That's okay. But in sparring, the thing is, is you've got somebody that might be – your partner might back up a little bit, right? So when you do that spin sidekick, you may or may not make contact with them, okay? And so you land in front, so that way then you can keep advancing with them. Okay, you want to always continue to keep advancing, all right? Unless there's certain circumstances where you don't. So, um, in other ways, landing behind you, not a bad thing, okay? But in my recommendation for sparring, okay, especially with tournament sparring and stuff like that, land in front, all right? It'll definitely help with what we're gonna do when we build from this as well, okay? All right, so like I said, not wrong by any means with landing in the back, but for this drill, I want you landing in front, okay? That also helps with having us go forward, which is what we need for when we start board breaking. You wanna land through it, you wanna go forward with it. All right, uh, let's see, we're on this side, I know we're on this side, I think I'm on number three. Okay, so go ahead, get your hands back up, get ready, get ready, moving side to side, and four. Very good, very good. I think I said, I think I'm on three and then I said four. That's all right. Here we go, and five. Very good, and just for purposes, just in case I've missed one, we're gonna do another five, you ready? And five. There we go. All right, now let's put the other leg in front. Here we go, now we're gonna do it this way. Since we switched feet, we gotta spin the other way. Okay, make sure you spin, figure out which way you gotta spin, which way feels comfortable, all right? Because if you're doing this, you're going to fall, okay? So you want to make sure you can spin all the way around to where then when you bring that foot up, you can continue through and see where you're going. All right, here we go. Hands up. And one. Good. And put it back behind you. Move it side to side. And two. Good. Moving, moving, moving. Moving and grooving. Three. Good, good, good. And four. Excellent. Hey, Miss McCarty, can you come make sure the air is on? I'm sorry. The air is on? Yeah. Yes, please. All right, and five. Good job. I don't know why, but for some reason out here, it feels like I'm in 90 degrees. So, she's gonna save the day. Not to say I couldn't teach in 90 degrees, but cool, it makes it uncomfortable. All right, here we go. So to add on from that, so we're gonna go ahead and put the other leg in front. Okay, we're gonna put the other leg in front. From here, what we're gonna do, we're going to take that leg, we're gonna do it, same side kick. We land it in front, back fist, and then cross. All right, back fist, then cross. So instead of just doing a jab, we're gonna now throw a back fist. Okay, from a back fist, you do not want to come all the way back here. All right, you don't want to show them what you're doing. All right, you want to here, come up, boom, just like so. All right, the other thing is, make sure we don't fully chamber, all right? Don't fully chamber, okay? Don't fully chamber like in our form. We want to here, just like so. Okay, we're sparring. All right, here we go. And then you're gonna bring that foot back behind you again. Here we go, moving, moving, moving. Hands up, do it with me one time, step by step. Spin side kick, back fist, and cross. Very good, very good. All right, we're gonna put that together now, y'all ready? And one. Good, and switch that leg back in front again. Two. Very good, moving side to side. And three. 
Very good, very good. Remember, staying relaxed, staying comfortable, staying bouncy. Don't have to bounce, bounce, but you want to stay, stay loose, all right? You want to be able to breathe. All right, and three. Good, 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 good. Excellent, excellent. And four. Awesome job. Ms. Riccardi, I appreciate you so much. I can feel that AC on. What? I can feel the AC. I appreciate it so much. No problem. Five. Good. All right. And put the other leg in front. Here we go. Next combination, or same combination, just the other side. So do it with me. The inside kick. Back fist. Cross. Very good. Very good. All right. Y'all ready? Here we go. Move in side to side. Get those hands up. Another thing that we usually don't say, have that chin down. All right, tuck your chin a little bit. Protect yourself. All right, here we go. And one. Good, very good. Awesome, Austin, I saw that. That was a good cross, buddy. And two. Good, very good. Excellent, moving from side to side. And three. Very good, very good. And four. Ah, I did it wrong. Ha ha ha. See, so even I mess up for most while. I wrote these combinations down. Here we go. And five. All right. So we'll count, we'll count that down with those combinations. What I want you to do now is I want you to grab a pillow, a focus target, a Anything that you can put on the ground and land on. Okay, I'm gonna grab a, I'm gonna grab a square blocker for B. All right, so something similar to this, whether it's a pillow, focus target, a blanket that's folded up, you know, something that you can land into. We're gonna put it on the ground. All right, so I know most of this group doesn't board break, but we're gonna work on some board breaking stuff. Okay, because eventually you will, right? So. This cycle, we're working on the axe kick. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take this leg, our back leg, we're gonna cross it over, then we draw a big line, and then draw another line down on the target. Okay, so I want you here, come up, and boom, land straight into it. Let's try that again, almost fell. So we're here, we land, boom, just like so. Notice I'm hitting with my heel first. Okay, I hit with my heel coming down. All right, hit with the heel first. All right, everyone, put on your heel. Let's see it. Make sure we know what our heel is. Point at that heel. All right, here we go. Ready? Hands up. And one. Good. And two. Very good. Very good. Three. Awesome job. Awesome job. And four. Excellent, last one, five. Very good, all right, let's do the other side now. Same thing, cross, draw the straight line up, straight line down, toes up in the air. Remember, when you get, when you throw the axe kick, you wanna get as high as you can for the axe kick. So that way then when you bring your foot down, gravity helps you all the way through. So the higher you get it, the stronger you're gonna kick. All right, you ready? Hands up, here we go, and one. Uh, for some reason, the first one always seems to fall. Two. And then after that, usually I'm all right. Good. And three. Excellent. And four. Good job. Good job. And five. Excellent. Excellent. All right. From here. We're gonna go ahead and jump into self-defense. All right, if you have somebody that you can partner with, whether it be mom, dad, brother, sister, and uncle or cousin, that's fine. If not, work it in the air just like I'm doing. Okay, we're gonna work on our self-defense. If you are helping, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take one hand, and you're gonna put it on their chest right here on their collarbone, okay, as if you are choking them. Okay, it's a one-handed choke, kids. Remember, 
what you're going to do is you're going to make a really big smile, biggest smile you can make. You're going to drop your chin as low as you can, squat down so you can't go nowhere. And then whatever side they're on, you want to take the thumb and you want to push the thumb away. All right, you're going to push that thumb away, smack the wall behind you, and then reverse elbow into them. All right, you should know this by now. We've been practicing all cycle. In case you want to, we need a couple more steps on those details, that's fine. So, here's a big smile. Tuck the chin, squat down, come around, and we're reverse elbow. Very good, very good. Excellent, excellent. All right, working both sides. I'll give you about 30 seconds or so. Working both sides. All right, I'll let you work it. I'm gonna do it, so if you wanna do it with me, you're more than welcome to. All right, if you got a partner, do it with them. There we go, about 10 more seconds or so. Get about two more tries, two or three more tries. Good, five. Four, three, two, one, and time. All right, from here, we're gonna go ahead and jump into the form for everybody. All right, we're gonna jump in the form. We're almost done with class here. Okay, so we're gonna go into the form motion now. Right now. All right, everyone, Jimmy. Okay, here we go, intermediate level. All right, everyone to the left, uh, inverted rich hand. Front kick, step forward, palm block up. Good, come all the way around, other side, inverted rich hand. Make sure you're in that cast dance. Front kick with front leg, step forward, palm block up. To the front, chamber, come to the front, double knife hand. Notice, number one thing I see a lot of times is when people are here, they don't step, so they do this. You gotta move that foot back to the front. Got to move that foot back to the front. Chamber, front stance, upward elbow strike. Back arm elbow, Dane. There we go. Other arm, Dane. There you go, bud. Take your hands all the way around, step forward, double knife hand. Good. Chamber, step out, upward elbow strike. Good. Make sure we're in a good front stance here. Good front stance. Step forward, double punch. And step forward, double uppercut. Oh, yeah. Very good. Now you're gonna take your hands to your belt. This back leg. Let's go back a little bit so you can see. I'm gonna take this leg, I'm gonna draw a line, come around, X block. All right, now from here, I do not wanna confuse anybody. I'm gonna do it facing you now so that way you can see all the movements, all the chambers. Okay, we're still gonna go to the left, uh, your left side. All right, the left side. So we're here, left leg in front, X block. We chamber our left hand on top. Back stands to the left side, back fist. We're gonna pull in, front stance, first punch. Very good, from here, this hand goes on top, feet come together, step back out, back fist. Step into a front stance, reverse punch. You are done with your form. That is the full intermediate level of the form. All right, so from here, do it one more time, a little bit faster, all right? A little bit faster, not too fast though. And then we'll let y'all practice on your own as we watch. All right, so everyone do me. Here we go. Bridge hand. Good, now I see some people doing super quick. All right, you don't wanna be too fast. You wanna be able to see the full chamber and everything. All right, front kick, step forward, palm block up. All the way around, inverted rich hand. Front kick, step forward, palm block up. To the front, double knife hand, upward elbow strike with the reverse hand, with the back hand. All the way around, step forward, double knife hand, reverse elbow strike. Step forward, double punch. Step forward, double uppercut. Oh yeah! Very good, draw the line, X block. Remember, I'm turning, but we're still going to the left. 
chamber, back fist. I'm gonna scoot up a little bit closer. Always be prepared as if I'm doing advanced class. Here we go, and pull back, and punch. Chamber that hand on top. To the right, back fist. Pull back, and punch. All right, team, from here, what I want you to do is I want you to work on your form, your pace, your counts. All right, your pace. I want you to work on it until we say stop. All right, me and Mr. Carter are gonna watch everybody, see how you're looking. Okay, for those of you that have already submitted your testing videos, still practice as if you're getting ready for testing, all right? Still get practice. All right, Dane, what's up, buddy? How many times do we do it? Until, I, until me or Miss McCarty get bored and, or go to sleep. If we fall asleep, then I want everyone to unmute yourself and scream to wake us up. How about that? And then we can stop. And I don't know about Miss McCarty, but I just drank a full large coffee, so I'm ready to go. All right, y'all ready? Jim before you form and begin. Other hand, Alexander, Poff. When you do that, uh, the palm block up. Oh, there you go, buddy. Good. Don't step with that elbow. You know better than that. There you go. Don't step with it, but just throw it. There we go. Now, excellent, good. Other way you wanna spin, you wanna spin the other way. All right, here we go, keep going, excellent. Very good, very good, buddy. Watch that again, just make sure. Good, 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 good. Ian, that was pretty good, man. You just forgot two moves, but that's pretty good for your first class, Ian. Don't forget right. your punch is the high and the upset punch, okay? The extra pressure on you, dude. I'm watching you now. Looks good, Miss Peyton. Good job, girl. Keep it up, girl. Austin, you all right, man? Good, Dexter. Good, good, good. All right, Ms. Picardi, have you watched Aiden yet? Aiden Bartley? Uh, no. All right, Aiden, I'm watching you now, dude. You're getting that sip of water, so that means you must be really good, right? Nice. Good power, I like the power. Oh, hold on, Aiden, hold on, hold on, hold on. You so go back to here. Time, go back to here, Aiden. Now remember, you step into a front stance. Back hand does the elbow. So this hand's gonna do the elbow. This hand's gonna do the elbow. So you're here, boom, perfect. Now step forward again, double punch. Step forward with it, there you go. And then, yep, and then step forward again, and double up the cut. There you go. Good. Good job, Austin, that looked good, bud. Excellent, Aiden, good job. All right, Azarel. Looks good, bud. Nice, like nice power there. Good job, Azarel. Mm -hmm. 
Make sure, Miss Crystal, when you step, do the uppercut, make sure you step forward with it. So after you're here, uh, let's see, boom, and you step forward, boom, just like so. Or other way around here. It's probably gonna be mirror. There we go. There you go. So from there, step forward again, and double uppercut. There you go. Ah, yeah. So you've already done that. So then hands up, and then. Now, if you've already done that, so when you're here, you do the double uppercut, come here, and then draw the circle. Excellent. There you go, yes, good. Perfect. Looks good, keep practicing. All right, I believe we've gotten through everybody. We've been, okay, cool. All right, so from here, we're gonna finish off class today with our splits challenge. How long we got, Miss McCarty? Minute 12 again. All right, minute 12, here we go. Y'all ready? Working on that flexibility. Everyone get down, splits. Hands out in front of you, and begin. Keep holding it, keep holding it. If you start to get to where you feel like it's not really doing much, you can take your leg out just a little bit more. Get as low as you can. Oh, hang in there. I see some faces hang in there, guys. Almost there. Doing great, you started. Don't, don't quit, don't quit, keep it going. Not much longer, not much longer. You got 10 seconds. Come on guys, we can do Just it. Do We've it done it for a minute too. We can, do it. we can do a minute, we got 10 seconds. All right, time. Very good. All right, from here. All right, I wanna say great job to everybody today. Y'all did an awesome job. All right, hope those combinations help you a little bit, especially with your testing. All right. And if you have any questions, you're welcome to stay on and ask. If not, you are good to go. You're good to go. Great job, Ian. Um, it's good to see you in the class, man.